Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to connect and mirror your Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 series to a TV or monitor. So as long as this TV has a HDMI uh, cable input, uh, this is supported. So what we're going to do is there are two methods of going about this. The first way is the most simple way you can see here, you're going to need to get a USB Type-C to HDMI cable. And so how this works is you plug in the USB Type-C part into the Tab S8 and you plug the HDMI part into the spare HDMI port on your TV. And once you've done that, everything is going to work. However, the recommended way is, first of all, you're going to want to get an adapter which converts USB Type-C into HDMI and also has the option for USB Type-A. I'll explain why in just a bit. And then the next step is you get a regular HDMI cable, which has, you know, the two HDMI ports uh, on each end. The first end you place into the TV. The second end you place into the adapter. And you can see I have now done that successfully. And so uh, you can see here, it did say the message that we've connected to an external display. And just like that, you can see my Tab S8 screen has been successfully mirrored uh, onto my TV. Now it's saying start Samsung DeX. I'll start it up in a bit, but for now I'm gonna tap on cancel. Because you can see, if I just zoom out here, every action I take on the, on the tablet is being mirrored to the TV. Now one thing to keep in mind is when you mirror your Tab S8 to the TV, the Tab S8 will be limited to 60 hertz. Uh, by default, the screen is at 120 hertz. So if you're wondering why it may look like the tablet is lagging after you mirror to the TV, that is why. So literally everything will be mirrored. Even if I change the orientation, you can see on the TV itself, the orientation has changed. There is an option to use Samsung DeX. So if you didn't tap on OK in that initial pop-up, in order to activate Samsung DeX now, what you're going to do is get your uh, finger here and you're going to slide down from the top of the display once. So slide down once and you're going to slide down one more time. And once you've slid down twice, you're going to see the DeX button tap into that one. Now, if you don't see it here, you can always swipe across until you see the DeX. And if you still don't see it, tap on plus, select DeX, and you're good to go. So let's tap on DeX. And what it's going to do now is you're going to see that on the TV, we're going to have Samsung DeX mode enabled. So we'll just give it a little bit for the Samsung DeX load up. You can see it has loaded up successfully. If you remember earlier on in the video, I said you're better off using the adapter which converts USB Type-C to HDMI and has USB Type-A ports. And the reason why is because when you're in DeX mode, what you can do is with the spare USB Type-A ports, you can connect your keyboard and your mouse, and then you can use that to control DeX mode on the uh, Tab S8 series. And what that means is if you would like, you see where the bottom right is, not the far bottom right, but right next to it with the battery, tap into that, just reduce the brightness to the lowest. And then from here, what you can do, connect your keyboard, connect your mouse, and then boom, you basically have a desktop experience on the big screen. So for some reason, there used to be a feature where you could actually control the DeX mode using your tablet itself. However, I've been doing a bunch of messing around. It seems like that option has been removed on the new Androids. I don't know why. However, that is just the case. So it's just something to keep in mind. So uh, you will need that keyboard and mouse. Therefore, having you know this would be better off. So that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye bye.